while the earth remaineth, seed time and harvest, and cold and heat, and summer and winter, and day and night, shall not cease. Genesis 8, verse 22. This is such an incredible study. Was Noah's ark a type of seed? Maybe even a foreshadow of the promised seed of Genesis 3, 15, which is Jesus? Genesis chapter 6 gives instructions on building the ark. It tells the size of the ark, and Noah is instructed to cover it with pitch for protection. He is to take his family and representatives of all the different kinds of animals. He also must take food for them to eat. Let's compare that with a seed. A seed typically has three main parts. The cotyledon, or food supply. The seed coat, like pitch, is a type of covering. The embryo, which is a type of genetic material, that's a type of the animals and people. When the ark went through the storm, it was like Jesus being scourged with a whip, beaten but not broken. He then was planted in the grave and rested the seventh day. Later the door or stone was removed. This was on Sunday, the eighth day, a new week, a new beginning. When the storm was over, the ark planted or rested on the mountains of Ararat. Jesus rested the seventh day. After some time, Noah removed the covering. Genesis 8, verse 13. This is like the stone being removed at the resurrection on the eighth day, and also like the seed coat being removed so the genetic material can be released. The embryo, this is Jesus resurrected, and Noah and the animals leaving the ark. There were eight people on the ark. Sunday is the type of eighth day. For yet seven days it rains. Genesis 7 verse 4. The new beginning is the eighth day, the eighth millennium. They leave the ark. The world will last 7,000 total years, then a new beginning. Now think of a woman's pregnancy, and it's time to deliver. The water flows. She breathes like wind. Genesis 8 verse 1. Now I don't want to offend anyone, but look at the picture and see if you see what I see. Read Romans 6 verse 5. For if we have been planted together in the likeness of his death, we shall also be in the likeness of his resurrection. While the earth remaineth, seed time and harvest shall not cease.